So you go to Cydia. Go to manage packages and uh oh wait, oops. Might be sourceless. Click edit. Hold on. Click edit up in the top. And then you're gonna click add. Right there is the uh, is the uh, what you wanna add. So you're gonna type in Cydia dot Hagkulo whatever dot us and then that's it but I'll show you so you click add then like I said you type in Cydia And hit add source. It's gonna come up and all that. So I add anyways. Now it's done, so you want to go in it, and since you're still on 4.0, check 4.0, like hers is checked for 4.1, check yours for 4.0, um, check, you know, everything you see here, check, you know, Haculus, security, install this, this is what you need is install this, so make sure that's checked and source GUI then you're done so then right here it is that's what the app looks like right there the green one in the middle just open it up it's gonna go through all this blah 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 Pretty much, you can search whatever you want. So, let's type in um, Angry Birds. So, this is the newest one that came out Angry Birds Seasons. I think I seen it in the app store for like 99 cents. Click download. It's gonna come up with all this. You see how it says 1.1.1? That's the newest version out. Out oh, right here. 1.1.1.0 1 .1 is the last version. So you always want to go to the newest. This pops up. And make sure you're really easy on which one you pick because you can see you download it for 750 or you just do it normally. So click normally. You enter in the little code that's displayed in the box. You gotta enter in that code right there so it looks like it's HC47. HC. Now, when you're done, you hit go. Then you gotta click, click that little link there. And you see it says started. So 
So you go to downloads, and right there it is up at the top. After it's done downloading, you click it. That's not the one, but you click it and you hit install, and then it will pop up like right there. And then you can do this with any app, paid versions um, or, or free versions, but I would do it only with paid versions because you can download free versions from the app store, but that's how you do it.